Hello, everyone. Welcome back to FA Channel. You are in a space where we celebrate our technology and creativity. Technology, of course. When you come to technology, there are always kind little problems here and there, and you sometimes a lot of our audience are struggling. And our channel is always try to make everything very simple and accessible for you to understand and to use. So this video particularly is a follow up of one of our pretty popular video that we talk about how to the easiest way to use perfect sync with your VRED avatar. And we got a lot of comments of people having the same problem that they said when they applied perfect sync on their VRED avatar with Face Forge, they have this problem with their the eye jittery and glitch. For this episode, we did a lot of experiment. We try to go to the VRoid, uh, we try to download different types of VRoid avatars and then different versions of VRoid Studio to make sure to try to figure out what's the problem. And then we did figure out. So this will solve your problem. Yeah, let's get started. So first thing we did is to go to booth.pm to download some free avatars with different files, different types of files. Some of the, uh, there are dot .vrm files and dot .vroid file. So v dot .vroid file is project file, dot .vrm file is exported file. In this case, we download a couple of .vroid file and one VR, .vrm file. And secondly, the next step, we download three different versions of vroid studio. 0.801 is the oldest version. 0.11.3 is the version that we used for our avatar. And then the latest version is 0.14.0. Now we just go to the VRite Studio and then try to make different types of phase. And then firstly, we use the 0.11.3 version to export different phase types. And then we use the oldest version, which is 0.8.0 to export a sample character. And then we use the latest version, the 0.11.3, uh, no, 0.14.0 to export another sample character. So we have all layout. Uh, yeah, try to figure out which one have the problem, which one doesn't. And then the, as you can see in the background, the latest version, they, the Vroid Studio have added a lot of new sample characters. Yeah, and then we also download one of the new sample to try. So we try to see if the new project file that they added works with the older, if it work with the older um, version of the VRoy Studio, which is like the 0.11.3 version. So at this point, I assume that you will have the perfect sync, the character that you need to download from booth.pm, apply the perfect sync, because we, we talk about that's the whole point about using uh, perfect sync. We will put the link underneath the video and we also put a cards here to if you wanted to look back into the video that we talk about the easiest way for perfect sync and, um, with VRoid avatar. So if you have questions, let us know. So assume that you have this perfect sync character that you download from the booth.pm and then you we were trying every single VRM file that we have so far to apply with a perfect sync. Now we're trying to figure out what is the problem. Before we even try it, we realize at this point, it's the older version, which is the 0.8.1. Sorry, I may made a mistake when I mentioned about the, the number. It's very hard to remember. I probably said 0.8.0. So we realized the older, the older version um, had the character, the, the the avatar has less polygons. As you can see, they were all showing the numbers here. So it has, they have less polygon and the newer versions are you are having the same, same numbers, same counts of polygons. So we were thinking that moment that probably that's the reason why 
it doesn't. Now we have to test with the VC face and the white dial. Oh. To do this, you will have to upload every single avatar file into the VRide hub. Then you can use white dial and VC face. One thing to keep in mind is that uh, when you download these characters from the booth.pm for the, per the applied perfect sync, that character, what kind of version they're using with the VRI Studio. For in our case, la in the last video, we kind of get lucky because we used 0.11.3 version. The VRI Studio version we're using is also 0.11.3, means what we're using the version is exactly the same with the creator's version. So that's why it works well. And while we're testing what we do, what we're testing with different avatar file with the perfect sync character, we realize if you're using different version, say if you have, if you are the perfect sync character that you download is using 0.11.3, and then you are using the studio, uh, VRI Studio, the latest version, 0. Point, you just downloaded it, you use the 0. 0.14 point zero, then your face start to, it's different kind of result than your, like, I will show you later, is your face start to look a little grumpy, and also when you move your eyebrow, it's kind of weird. And if you use oldest versions, actually even worse, and your whole face is like jittery the whole time. So basically the problem is you have to use the same same VRI Studio version to apply perfect sync with for face forge to be able to get the best result. Let's go I, I tried basically every single avatar we're exporting. Let's go take a look and I'll show you how it looks. Okay. Wow. This is the older version. And apparently <laughs> my mouth doesn't even move and then it's jittery and and glitch like a oh, horrifying was like ghost in the shell <laughs> but yeah it's it's definitely not right and then i don't know why the mouth doesn't work yeah anyway let's try another one add another one <laughs> okay <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> This is the 0 0.11.3 version. <laughs> this one, even though the face we tried to make it overly customizing, we didn't consider it at all. Like we didn't think what kind of <laughs> it's actually working well. Can I blow cheek? Oh yeah. Oh <laughs> it's actually although it looks terrifying, but it works pretty well. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that means it works if you have the same version. And then let's try another one. Okay. Okay. Wow. See, this is like a even a, a very different kind of avatar characters, but it's also. 0.11.3 version and then see it's doing really well wow i actually really like this <laughs> the hair is so flowy <laughs> oh i like this one so yeah this one works like when i shake my head just see on my white dial app it's the hair looks amazing wow this is cool cool so next, let's try, what is it? <laughs> oh no. So, okay, so this is the latest version. 0.14.0 oh yeah see oh yeah when I close my eyes there's a problem looks grumpy <laughs> and it's not right definitely not accurate so the latest version have 
slightly less problem than the oldest version, but still is not right. Okay. So cool. So this is the same model, but with the same versions of Vroy Studio. Now you can see when I move my eyebrow, it's have zero problem. So you can you can tell the difference. I just tried the other one with the latest version. This is the one with the same. Yeah, working pretty well. <laughs> cool. Yeah, I guess that's that helps. So if for those of you already have your VRM file, um, I we we provide the link that we find on uh, with this be it. Uh, with the perfect sync applied avatar we'll put underneath the video so because we only can find the perfect sync applied avatar with 0.11.3 version so just download that and export your own file with the same version which is 0.11.3 and then use faceforge to apply and then that's all problem solved yeah that's it <laughs> Okay, so yes, that's it. I really hope you can solve the problem because yeah, you know, this kind of technical problem can make me crazy. And then, and then once you figure out, you feel better. Yeah, but actually the theory is pretty simple. You just can't mix up all different versions. Hope this is helpful, guys. Let me know if you still have problems. I hope it's not. And if you don't have the project file you can also do it manually we mentioned it in the previous the video but that is not the easiest way yeah you have to use blender unity but still if you're interested to know please, please comment our youtube below we will make a video about it whatever you guys want cool that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching Please subscribe our channel for new updates every week. Excited to see you guys again in the next video. I'll yeah, keep you posted about every new exciting virtual tools experience. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye. <laughs>